Hi guys, back here as I go through the paints. So there was the blue, the pearl, the purple and the green. Um, welcome to video 10 for my YouTube channel. And so seeing as we've hit double digits, I have decided to do two pieces in this video. Piece number one is planning on a drag flip and drag there we go flip and drag so I actually spritzed this cup with some silicone uh, prior to adding the paint because um, I learnt this from another channel and I'm really sorry I can't remember which one but if you spritz it the paint just literally pulls away from the cup so you've got less wastage I think there you go it's right there so I'm adding the white paint around so I can do the drag. So I haven't actually done this technique before. So I've certainly left it for a whammy, hey? Double digits. Let's check it out. So my next piece today will be on an 8x8 canvas. So that will be a flip cup aiming for cells. Oh, look at those colours. I'm dragging and I love the effect that's kind of like really feathery and now I've just gone and like totally dragged too much, leaked too much, I don't know, too much paint. Gosh, and it looks so muddy. That beautiful bright green has just disappeared. It's like a bit of mud. Then oh, there's a flash of purple in there. That looks nice. But so as I tilt it around and get a lot of zigzagging going on, so it's really not the way I thought it would be. Not, not how I planned it in my head, you know, as these things don't because, you know, it's totally random and you go with the flow because that's why we do this. So yeah, it's just another project that I'll be trialling again. So... Yep, I look forward to that. Right, put this one off to dry. Okay, grab the 8x8. So this one is going to be the flip cup. And we're aiming for cells. A uh, previous video that I did that I got my first cells, amazing cells, with silicon. Um, just made me so keen to try another one, so... I thought these colours would be really beautiful for that. Um, and I really love how they go into the cup here. They mix and they make like such a pretty pattern as they go in. So sometimes it looks like a flower. Oh gee, look at that. Yep, flowers abound. Artwork, you know, can't go wrong. Well, <laughs> I just did. <laughs> okay, okay, flip, flip, flip. Alright, so let's see. Because there's still some silicon left in the cup, most of it has pulled away from it. So that's great. And there we go. Oh, look at that. It is coming out of the cup like I thought it would. Um, but I am seeing a lot of that muddy colour again. Like that vibrant green is completely gone in another pore. Oh, some of it's come back. That's nice. Let's see how that goes. I had cells. And seriously, I just stretched them all out again. Okay, I need to work on that. <laughs> so, bit of a touch up. So if you like what you're seeing, guys, please subscribe me a thumbs up and leave a comment below if you've got any suggestions on color combinations or styles that you might like to see I also will have videos coming soon on screen printing wire wrapping crystal trees you know a fair few things but at the moment it's just the focus on the acrylic pouring so I thought here I would add these lines but what I forgot 
was when people add ribbons, uh, they actually mix the paint and add the ribbons. So, whereas I just did them straight, you know, so that was a bit, bit of a thing that I've realised after the fact and gone, oh, gee, you do first, you know, all good. Remember that next time. So, there we go, just trying to level them out a bit. Yeah, but that paint is running so fast, I really couldn't stretch that any further. So I actually thought, um, if I put some lines on the sides, which you're seeing right now, um, and use a straw and blow across them, because I looked at this piece and I just like went, okay, now it's time to experiment. So I thought, oh, that was really good. And I actually discovered that last time I was blowing into the paint, whereas this time I was more blowing across the paint. And I really like this effect a lot more. So that's good. Oh, wow. Yes. There is some vibrant green there. <laughs> oh, and it was hiding on the bottom. So I wasn't overly pleased with that too. So here comes a swipe. And you can see still so popping through already. So thanks for taking this journey with me. I'll catch you all again soon. I hope you enjoyed the video and take care guys. Bye.